dark chocolate keto nugget is the subject of today's food for thought. Good evening, my name is Jodie Bunting and this is another one of our live coaching videos, not a coaching video, a slim tip video where I get to show you something exciting that you can eat and not put on weight. So this is, well you sort of can, especially if you're doing keto, if you're doing low carb or something or you're trying to cut the crap out of your diet then this is for you now i'm really excited first of all it's from costco and what it is let me just show you the picture really close up so it's basically a big clump of chocolate crunchy stuff so when you when i look at that picture i just think of kind of a a cornflake cake a rice crispy cake you know something quite processed got a lot of stuff in there but tastes amazing and that's what this is but basically it's a healthy version so what it's full with is pecans almonds and hemp seed now the reason it's got hemp seed in uh, for anybody who's vegan or anybody who uh, doesn't have a full spectrum of fruit and vegetables and meat and stuff um, hemp contains lots of minerals and vitamins that you can't get in meat product or you can get in meat product products so these products in particular are really good for vegans anybody who's on the keto diet low carb this is great for you because again it's got all those things to keep you healthier now, before we do the taste test, uh, which I'm really excited about, I'm just going to tell you the information first. As I said, it's a mix of pecan, almonds and hemp seeds uh, in dark chocolate. So it's nice and strong tasting. We'll also talk about in a minute what you would actually do with these. How would you would bring it into your diet? So first of all, there's two, sorry, there's two grams of sugar and three net carbs per 20 gram serving now per 20 gram serving there is around 100 calories guys so it's not something that's super low in calories it's more something nutritious that if you for instance sprinkle this on the top of some nice natural plain yogurt it's going to taste amazing it's going to feel like you've got some sort of chocolate granola or some sort of chocolate cake on top of it and because it's got the almonds and the pecans in it's going to blow you away. It tastes so good. Um, so as I said, keto friendly, uh, organic, non-GMO, gluten free, vegan friendly, no artificial colours. Um, and let's go through the ingredients now. So I'll put the I'll put it really close. Why read the ingredients? Do I need to go that way? There we go. So there is in here organic dark chocolate, which is cocoa mass, organic cane sugar and cocoa butter so that's the only uh, bit of sugar in there and uh, then it's got pecans coconut almonds pumpkin seeds great i love pumpkin seeds organic hemp seeds uh, brown rice syrup maple syrup uh, ether etheritol which is a uh, natural sweetener organic coconut butter himalayan salt organic chia seeds all oh, chia seeds i didn't realize they were in there as well um and something called algae of fiber natural flavorings that's it guys so again it hasn't got hundreds and hundreds of ingredients like you would expect in normal kind of chocolate bars or or cakes of this product um what does it say let's let's read the the, the thing on the back because it always jazzes it up a bit doesn't it it all starts with a premium belgium covered dark chocolate the difference a quality flavor and texture that is no comparison free from additives <coughs> and emulsifiers uh, our chocolate is as pure as the smile that it comes from i'm just trying to read anywhere where it actually says what you would do with them. Because I know in my mind what I would do with these, but it doesn't have any serving suggestions. Shall we try it, guys? So there's 500 grams in here. Uh, there's 500 calories per 100 grams. So if you accidentally ate the whole bag, 2,500 calories over a day's calories in here. So be careful, guys. Once you open this bag, you don't want to... Have, it, have the lot. Let me just do that close up so you can see it's just a big mixture of nuts covered with chocolate. 
So as I said, what I would do with this is it's a 20 gram serving. So you're probably talking like a tablespoon. Now I've got a teaspoon just so you can see it. Maybe, can you see that there? And in there you can see you've got the covered nuts with the chocolate and there's maple syrup, etc, etc. So let me give this a taste. Now you wouldn't normally have it as poor, um, pure. You're not meant to just dig in with <laughs> it. It is meant to be a top pound. Really strong. A lovely chocolatey flavour. I'm not trying to say it tastes horrible, but it takes some chewing in a good way. You know, it feels like there's something there that you want to get your teeth into. And as I said, this sort of thing is perfect just to sprinkle onto um, yogurt. Or you could even, if you've got some, now we're going into the winter, if you've got some fruit that is not so sweet and it doesn't taste particularly good, having a little sprinkle on some uh, frozen berries, for instance, they're always quite bitter. So this combination will add the nutrients as well as making it taste nice as well. So that was the dark chocolate keto nuggets uh, that my friend saw uh, at Costco. I'm not sure how much they were. I should imagine they were quite pricey uh, because a lot of keto products are, aren't cheap, are they? I'll find out. Right guys, that's it from me. Um, you, you've probably seen, we've got something new on here, uh, which is called Stars. You can now tip Jodie Bunting. So whenever I'm live, if you like something I say, you can send me a tip, guys. So if you want to send me a tip and you've got a spare 89p, send me a tip. Thanks, guys. Bye for now.